scalars and vectors. Classification of physical quantities. In this module, we will discuss about classification of physical quantities. Physical quantities are classified into scalars and vectors. Scalar quantity. A physical quantity which is described completely by a number with proper units is called scalar. It has no sense of direction. Scalar quantities such as length, mass, time and temperature have magnitude only. These physical quantities are called scalars. Let us measure the length of an object AB by a scale. Here the length of AB is equal to it is a number. Now measure the temperature of water. Here the temperature is centigrade. It is a number. Similarly calculate the time. For example T is equal to 50 minutes and measure the mass of an object for example m is equal to 10 kg these are also numbers these physical quantities described completely by a number with proper units these physical quantities are called scalars length time mass temperature volume density are some examples of scalars vector quantity a physical quantity which has both magnitude and direction is called a vector here the vector is represented by an arrow the length of an arrow is the magnitude of the vector this arrow pointer indicates the direction of vector. The length of a vector is proportional to the magnitude of the vector. Vector quantities have both magnitude and direction. Example for scalar and vector quantities. Distance and displacement. Distance. Distance is a scalar quantity that refers the actual length of the path covered by a moving object. Here we can see an object is moving from one point to another along the path towards east. This path shows distance. Displacement Displacement is a vector quantity. It has both magnitude and direction. The magnitude of displacement is the shortest distance between the initial and final positions of the object. This vector shows the displacement of a moving object. Examples of vector quantities Displacement, velocity, acceleration, force, momentum, angular momentum, etc.